In this tutorial we will quickly go over art mapping function both for Lottie and for regular usage. So first we will go over art mapping for the regular use with extrudalizer. This option is not exportable to Lottie. So the process is very simple. We select the extrudalized layer and we click map art. We are presented with a dialog where we can select the extrudalized layer if there's more than one and a checkbox here but that's only used if you do want to export this to Lottie and here we're selecting the faces that we want to map the artwork to so here let's try to do for both front and back so using shift we select both options and click proceed and now it's done Two additional pre-compositions are created with artwork mapping for the back and for the front. Those two pre-compositions contain templates for the placement of the artwork. Let's double click on one and we're presented with uh, a pre-composition with the original path that is extrudalized placed face front. So let's say we want to map uh, a video. It can be an image, a video, or whatever you'd like. So let's resize this video artwork so it covers everything. And then we can use the template shape as a mask. Let's enable the fill. Here we are. And then we can use it as a mask. Now we're presented only with this shape. Let's do the same thing for the back. Make sure that the scale is the same. Here we are, and now that we have mapped the artwork to the template, we can return to our main composition. We can see that it's a little bit offset. So what we need to do is enable the corner pins in the effects of each of the pre-compositions for art mapping. So we click here, and we click here. Now, we can see it all mapped perfectly and we can see that if we rotate the shape the artwork moves with it it's mapped no matter how we move the shape how we change it we can change its position we can change the scale the artwork moves with it Great, now let's um, work on mapping for Lottie. Here I prepared an extrudalized shape of a toy rocking horse. We can see that it's already extrudalized and we can rotate it any which way we like. Now, to prepare this for extrudalization, we select the layer we want to have artwork mapped to, and we click Map Art. We check the box that it is for Lottie, and we deter and we say for which faces we want to map it: front and back. We click Proceed. Now we have two templates created for the front and for the back. Now let's start with the front. If we untwirl the layer, there is going to be a group called Artwork Wrapper. Inside this group we have to paste the vector artwork that we're going to map to the shape. So I've prepared the artwork layer here. 
you can see it now we just we, if it's not in one group we can group it by pressing command G or selecting group shapes we copy this group we go to the artwork wrapper select it and paste our group inside usually it's placed somewhere incorrectly so with the group selected we can just drag it to the correct place let's zoom in and fix it up we can disable the extrudalized layer for now just to make it work a little faster okay. so we want to make sure that the artwork covers the entire template it doesn't matter so much that stuff goes out because it's going to be masked out seems good so now we can disable the origin path and stroke so we don't see it and in the layer effects panel we can enable transforms and enable the mask and here it is mapped to the front of the extrudalized shape we do not see the back that's why we do not see the template for the back but let's uh, turn the art uh, turn the extrudalized shape around here and now we see the, the template for the back artwork let's repeat the same thing and we do not need to see the extrudalized shape for now we we'll copy this group we twirl open the back content layer back artwork content layer go to the artwork wrapper and paste it inside again let's position it seems good now we do not need to see the origin path and stroke we enable transforms enable mask now the back is mapped so now no matter how we rotate the horse the front and back is map Here you are.